Hi and welcome to this edition of our YouTube channel. Today we're going to talk about the 42 form. This is the introductory explanation just to give you an idea of what the form is about and then you can watch each individual movement, the sequence movements as separate videos. The 42 has been around since 1989 when the Chinese got together and tried to decide on a standardized form that incorporated a bunch of techniques from all of the other different styles. That's what makes this particular form unique and, quite frankly, the best form that's out there because it doesn't fit within just one system. It incorporates some of the best techniques from all of the different systems. So this one is one of my favorites because you're not stuck just doing a Yang style or just doing a Sun style or just doing a Chen style. You get to incorporate all of them within them. So this one is referred to by some people as comprehensive Tai Chi Chuan. So, in teaching this particular form, we stress keeping the form names, but what you will see is the intention or the actual techniques will vary just a little bit. And that's because one of the things that we teach is understanding exactly what the martial arts technique is for there. So I'll explain that as you go in through each individual movement, but I want you to get at least an appreciation for the overall form. Understand that you're able to tweak some of these things as you want. If you're in competition, you're training for this particular form, you're going to want to do it a certain way. But if you're just actually uh, incorporating this into your overall Tai Chi Chuan practice, you're able to tweak a few things in, in your intent. So if you see somebody else doing the 42 online, it might look just a little different than this. That's okay. This is uh, my interpretation or my teacher's interpretation of particular uh, techniques within there. So enjoy them. The, the, the names will be the same all the way through and by all means you're going to keep the sta your standard Tai Chi Chuan principles. Uh, we'll, we'll talk about those a little bit as we go through each individual um, technique. Um, and if you're interested there is an actual book out there by Lee Dayin. I'll put a photo here at the end of the video so you can actually see the book. Um, it will actually explain everything in his interpretation. He's the, the founder of this particular uh, technique for standardized testing so read the book you'll get a, a, at least an appreciation for his view and then hopefully you can watch all of the other videos uh, within this series as you're going through and you're actually you're doing your practice we'll break each one of these forms up as I do the practice into uh, some individual components first we'll talk about the name and, and the, the actual number within the, the sequence I'll do a quick demonstration of those we'll do some detailed instruction talk a little bit about common mistakes that we see people um, doing. We'll do an actual martial arts application so that you can actually see what's supposed to be happening. And then I'll incorporate the movement before each movement, that movement, and where it transitions into the next movement. So you can at least see a three movement running rotation. That'll help you uh, move in and out of the transitions for there. So thank you for watching this particular video. If you haven't already done so, please subscribe. And if you enjoy these videos, there's a link on the video if you'd like to donate to the effort. Uh, we do this for free. However, uh, we, we certainly accept contributions to help, to help the effort uh, go through. So thank you for watching this particular one. Tune into some of the individual movements as well as the overall form once everything is out there. And uh, enjoy. Thank you.